Hello everybody. Today's activity is the egg drop challenge. The idea is to find household materials and build a home to protect the egg as it falls from a tall distance. In my home, I found a cardboard box, some plastic bags including a small Ziploc bag, toilet paper, tape, the eggs, a sock or some clothing material, flour or brownie mix, and if you want, a piece of paper to track down your results. I'm going to be trying out two tests today. For the first one, you're going to need a few plastic bags. I have five. Toilet paper, tape, and the egg. Start off by grabbing some toilet paper, as much as you want. Grab the egg and wrap it around the toilet paper. With the tape, tape it in place. It should have something like this. Now grab one of your bags, fold it in squares. Place the egg right in the middle and start wrapping the plastic bags around the egg. And again with the tape, hold it in place. Continue that until you run out of eggs. You should have something like this. This is the first test. We're gonna set it aside and get ready for test number two. For test number two, you're gonna be needing the small little Ziploc bag, the egg, and the powder substance that you found at home. I have flour and some brownie mix. So what you're gonna do is Pour some of your mix into the bag, I'd say about half. Place the egg right in the middle. And pour the remaining powder. Close the egg. And now we're ready to test them out. We're ready to try out what we made. Find a hard surface in or outside your home. I'm going to use my bathroom and stand on a chair. If you're going to stand on a chair too, make sure that you have a, an adult that is present. Let's go ahead and test them. Start off with test number one, which is the plastic bags and toilet paper. How it does. Oh, it feels squishy. Oh, don't drop it twice. Let's try out test number two. Again, stand on the chair. Let's see how this does. And it's arrived, yay! Let's go ahead and record it on our sheet. So we can see that the plastic bags with the toilet paper were a fail and the Ziploc bag with the brownie mix and the flour were a pass. Now with any remaining material see what else you can create. Have fun!